So yo guys, what is going on and welcome back to a brand new Star Wars Battlefront gameplay But this time we have an invincibility glitch Now this invincibility glitch was found by Kyle and Jake Also known as Proxy on Twitter and YouTube And what you have to do is pretty much this glitch I'm not encouraging everyone to do it again But if you spawn on the side of the Imperials What you have to do is basically come over to this downed Republic ship Use a boost pack to jump on top of it and pretty much all you have to do is work your way into the second section down here. Obviously you've got to wait for your boost pack again or you can try and run up here. I think if you can run up there but you have to like jump loads of times and things like that. And it just takes a long time and just slide back down a lot. And it's really quite annoying. But once it's recharged again you just have to literally jump up. And then you're inside of one of the metal parts on the Republic ship. You can obviously see through down into one of the control points for the empire if you actually are in third person you can shoot and obviously throw grenades and stuff down there but while you're actually inside this you are invincible you can't be shot but you also can't shoot out which is a bit crap it is an invincibility glitch so obviously once you're inside of here nobody can actually kill you and if you want to actually shoot out like i said you just pop to these little points all around the place but no one can actually shoot you while you're actually inside of it so that is the invincibility glitch now i honestly didn't find this like i said it was jake and kyle proxy on twitter youtube go and check them out the link will be in the description below they originally posted the video saying they found this i just kind of took the idea and went with it because what we're trying to do is get this glitch actually tweeted to ea and star wars in general dice everyone like that to try and get it patched before the Battle of Jakku map actually gets released to the public on December 8th, I think it is. But there's another thing I actually want to show you in this video. This isn't the only thing I actually have. Now, over here, it's just a little bit further away from the invincibility glitch spot. I'm trapped in that little glitch there. But basically, this is an actual god spot on this map. You can't be touched in here, I swear to god. It's actually so good to hide inside here. Nobody really sees you, like I said. Everyone can pretty much just walk past you. And then you can just pretty much shoot out. Try and get the kills. You can be shot in that spot though. You can actually be shot. But it makes it at the start of the map really hard for the rebels to actually see you. Because you blend in with the ship. But obviously you can still be shot. So it makes it a bit poor that way. But it works really well if you don't actually want to use the glitch. You can go in there and use just sort of using the cover that the map actually gives you. So it's not really a massive exploit and it's not a glitch. It's not cheating. You are just literally using the map to your own advantage so that's all i really wanted to show you guys today in this video if you've liked this video please obviously leave a like and go and check out prox's video and leave a like on that as well because they're the guys who originally came up with this i just literally took it on board and added the little god spot to the video but other than that guys like i've said that's it smash a like obviously if you've enjoyed it and you are going to use the god spot please don't use the glitch that much if you are going to use it, obviously I can't stop you guys from using it. Please, please, please don't use it. Just use this video and Jake and Kyle. So obviously tweet it at EA and DICE to try and get rid of the glitch before the game actually comes out. Please, I'm actually begging you. Please don't use it. Please don't use it. But obviously it's there if, you know, you all out there do decide that you just want to actually use the exploit and get the advantage over everyone else. Other than that, like I said... That's been it for this video and I hope you tune back in tomorrow for my first impressions of the Battle of Jakku map. It is awesome. You know, it, it's one of the hard maps to play on. But like I said, you'll see my first impressions tomorrow. Other than that, guys, that's been it. I do hope you've enjoyed it. And I shall see you again tomorrow. So may the force be with you.